Can you guys have an A here, me? Can everybody hear? Yeah. yeah. Hey guys, come over. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being here. This is a very, very important day for our wild animals, and it's a very, very important day for our democracy. We have an incredibly unexpected, I suppose, I would say, an incredibly good result today and it's not the way that any of us really imagined things would work out. What's happened is, I don't know if you know already, but what's happened is the government has backed down. Because I wanted to see that democratic I wanted to see that democratic vote. I wanted to see us win that vote. But what's happened is the government have withdrawn the debate and withdrawn the vote because they know that they couldn't win it. Does anyone have a megaphone so we can hear him? I feel very disappointed because this is democracy at work, but it's not the way we would like it to work. We would not like our government and our Prime Minister to proceed by a series of underhanded tricks, would we? No! We would like to see him play things fair. Can you put your placard down low? It's like so supposing you had a boat race and then the day before the boat race Thanks. somebody says, oh, we can't win this, so we'll not run. We'll not, we'll not, we'll not run. It, it's, a, it's a rather cowardly way of doing things and we only got here, we only got to this vote because they knew they couldn't win the repeal vote. This was a dirty trick in itself. Yeah. So I want to say thank you to you guys for being here on a work day. It means a lot. I want to say thank you to all the literally hundreds of thousands of people who have emailed their MP. Yeah. Please keep emailing your MP. We are, we are producing a democracy which works. David Cameron is evil! Yeah. Don't make it about that. It's about the fox. Don't make it about yes, politics. Make it about I believe probably we could have won this vote without the SNP because we have a large number of, of Tory MPs, very, very conscionable people on our side. But the SNP came in and made it a war party. We're we'll so incredibly we'll indebted to the SNP. We'll and who has to say that the SNP democratically yeah. elected people I'd just like to say thank you because this is a team effort. This is Team Fox. It's all of you guys. It's also the RSPCA. It's IFRA. It's PISA. It's HSI. It's the League Against Cruel Sports. It's Corn Free. It's Hands Off. It's Viva. It's Lush. And our own charity campaign, Save Me. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a win. We have not yet won the war. There's no room for complacency, but this is a win. And today and tomorrow, Foxes will not be pushed back into persecution yeah. in the Dark Ages as they were before the hunting yeah. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce you to the leader of the SNP in the House of Commons, Angus Robertson. Thank you very much, Brian. I'm very proud to speak to somebody who was born in Wimbledon. <laughs> First of all, today is your victory. You have won today. It is because what have you have been doing in recent weeks and months that has persuaded MPs, MPs like myself, to take part in the debate, to take part in the vote. And what seems to have happened is that it was obvious to David Cameron that after the decision by the SNP group last night that we would take part in the vote and we would oppose the government, that the government would lose. My message to David Cameron is you're a coward. the vote 
result is that you knew you would lose. Exactly! What you need to understand is that people throughout the length and breadth of the UK have come together as never before to campaign on an issue that really matters. I've been an MP now for, for quite a while. I have never, ever received so many emails. In the course of organizations that have been encouraging you to lobby your MP, email your MP, turn up at the surgeries, and it shows you that whilst democracy is imperfect, on this day you have won, and that really matters. But let's not lose sight of things. We have won the battle, not the war. We're not going anywhere yet. We will make sure, and the part that we can play in this, which I think is really exciting, is that I know that my colleagues in the Scottish Government are now going to look at reforming legislation north of the border. Yeah! We will work together with our friends from the rest of the UK and the UK Parliament wherever we can to back progressive causes. That was what we were going to do. Unfortunately, the government's now pulled the vote, but you need to be certain in the knowledge. We would have won, and we would have won because of you. Exactly! You No, it's not. No. Who's that then? No. Stand in the mention that. Stand in the mention that. Oh. 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 O